we are back at it again here with another video with the invest for tomorrow to the first time viewers and investors welcome to the channel to all subscribers welcome back i'll ask for returns for the smash that like button tell me you watch this video helps out the youtube channel and lets me know you'll appreciate the time and effort i put into making these videos so here we are with bbig stock vinco ventures inc and the stock continues to struggle holding itself up and there's some key levels we're going to talk about in today's video but it wasn't the only stock falling the spy did as well in the overall market and our spy bot at 9 50 a.m sent us out a bear indicator and from that moment forward put options went up nearly 200 percent plus within minutes guys and this is our new release that allows us to have an edge within the volatility of the markets to maximize on opportunities whether stocks are going up or going down and you can now gain access to it as well the link is down below in the description to the 42 vision indicator getting connected to the spy bot the qqq bot our newly released tesla bot and we have other bots on the way so that you can receive the clarity and edge that you deserve within the volatility of the markets to maximize on opportunities and you can now join the members using these resources to maximize in either direction by receiving that clarity and edge over the charts so in today's video we are going to talk about some key levels that you do not want to miss you definitely want to stick around for all this information especially with the full transition that has happened on 42 vision but before we break it down i want to share with you guys the home run opportunity i mentioned this morning over at the discord so the home run of the day was spectacular and beyond expectations and if you guys want to know about these stocks early on in the pre-market check out the link down below in the description to the discord and by joining you'll become part of a growing community of investors all looking to learn and grow together and we strive for opportunities like these every single day so these are the three stocks i mentioned this morning every single one of them jumped up three to five percent five to ten percent plus but one of them turned out to be a home run and that was vrm we caught this one in the pre-market under a bull indicator and going into full strength on 42 vision had a slight jump when we caught it pulled back down towards the bell and spiked up to a highest point of 20 percent plus guys within minutes if you guys want to know about these stocks early on in the pre-market check out the link down below in the description to the discord we strive for opportunities like these every single day and we look forward to having you join us let's jump into these charts so here we are with bbig stock vinco ventures inc and as i stated earlier in the video bbig stock continues to struggle to break through key resistance levels and find support right but based off 42 vision we have seen a full transition from bright green to white with red borders and we're going to talk about how significant that is within this chart even when it tried right here but the reversal was way too weak so that's what we're going to break down here in today's video based off the 30 minute we're going to look at the four hour and the one day i'm going to go ahead and pull up ultimate 42 vision the bull and bear indicators which you can now gain access to as well the link is down below in the description to the 42 vision indicator getting connected to the spy bot the qqq bot our newly released tesla bot and we have other bots on the way so that you can receive the clarity and edge that you deserve within the volatility of the markets to maximize on opportunities and you can now join the members using these resources to maximize in either direction by receiving that clarity and edge over the charts so bbig stock has been under a bear indicator since yesterday in the pre-market at 324 popped back up to the 339 area rejected 340 came back down and found support here between 290s and three dollars and i stated we need to see this break back above three dollars and if it breaks through it which is a key support level based off the history of the chart we could see this go lower and here we are in the 270s and 280s so this bear indicator signified further weakness since we saw it especially when it rejected four dollars and if it broke through three dollars based off the support and it did that yesterday and that's how we've ended up here so we have some key levels to talk about now i'm gonna zoom on in and make this a shorter time frame so that you guys could see how significant why with red borders are so when we hit why with red borders right there tends to be reversals some are weaker than others some are stronger and right now on the 15 minute this one was pretty strong and then these right here 
were pretty weak, right? These last two times. But if you zoom out and you look at this from the 30 minute, the last time we hit white with red borders was way down here on the 26th to the 27th. And look at all that strength going up to this point. So on the 30 minute, it's the first time that we see white with red borders pop up consecutively. And yesterday to today, it tried popping up and it went from 280s to highs here of $3, almost 10%. And then today it hit lows here of 260s, back to almost 290s, almost $3, and it went up 10 to 15%. And that's where 42 Vision comes and shows us the dips and the rips. Why we're Fred Borders is extreme weakness. Bright green is extreme strength. This is the rip area. This is the dip area. And this has been a complete transition to the downside. And the born bear indicators are there to confirm the extra layer of confirmation of the direction either downwards or upwards, right? So the fact that 42 Vision is showing a white with red borders here, it's super important to be watching this because this is a dip area. Now it does not signify or guarantee that it's gonna go right back up and complete the transitions from red with green borders to dark green and bright green like it's done before, like right here. But if a bull indicator pops up, there could be further strength here and resistance levels could be tested. So super important to be aware of the fact that yes, it's in a dip area, doesn't guarantee a reversal. And this could have been the reversal right here and not strong enough. And this could continue back down. That's where the support and resistance levels come into play. And also if it does go into strength and pulls itself back up and breaks through key resistance levels, well, we want this bear indicator to get canceled out by a bull indicator in the process so there are a lot of things to analyze when things are moving within the volatility and in the bigger picture and so forth so right now we are under a bear indicator here on the 30 minute on the four hour it's under a bear indicator as well full transitions here from bright green to dark green with red borders if this continues and goes into red bars we could go into further weakness but this bear indicator had not popped up until today in the pre-market, which cancels out this bull indicator. And that's super important because that signifies that in the bigger picture here on the four hour, there could be further weakness, even though within the 30 minute, there could be some movements, right? And then on the one day, we have had a complete shift here from bright green to dark green with red borders. No bear indicator just yet. We're still under a bull indicator, but still a lot of weakness on the four hour when you take a look at it on the chart right so we go right over here to the four hour you could see that that bear indicator is there and things are transitioning if this goes towards a red bar that would signify even further weakness and if you look at it here this is a great example of another full transition from extreme weakness in the dip area getting that bull indicator as an extra layer of confirmation and going upwards into bright green two times and consolidating here and never getting a bear indicator that pulled it down and this bull indicator dominated the chart that's what 42 vision is all about in the bigger picture and even the smaller time frames whether you're a scalper day trader swing trader it works on all time frames one minute five minute three minute and also the one hours and the 30 minute and 45 minute and so forth so it all depends on what your trading style is and what your goals are when it comes to a trading opportunity. So here we are with the 30 minute again, and we are in that dip area, trying to hold itself up in the 270s. And the lows of the day were 267, 268, give or take. And the highs here were $3. And you could see that rejection there, how it tried to come back up as well and reject it at the 297 mark and at that $3 mark to be exact. That is a key resistance level and support level if the bulls can break above it to bring themselves up even higher. Super important to be aware of this and pay close attention to these key levels to the upside. If that's broken through, the next one's up here around 340. Look how many times it's rejected up here. That is a key level of resistance that needs to be turned into support so that the bulls can then push up even higher, right? Those are the key levels again to the upside but we're under a bear indicator 
And if the bulls can start bringing this back up, even though the four hours under bear indicator and the one day is pulling downwards, but on the 30 minute, it can pull it back up. Hopefully a bull indicator can pop up and cancel out this bear indicator in the process. Now to the downside, if you look at it here from the bigger picture, 268 is the lowest point of today. But then down here at the 255 mark, right? On the four hour. But when you come here to the 30 minute, it's 253. So I would just round that down to 250. That is the key support level to watch if the bulls are losing traction and the bears are putting more pressure. And to receive clarity within the charts, check out the link down below in the description to the 42 vision indicator. Getting connected to the spy bot, the QQQ bot, our newly released Tesla bot, and there's many more bots on the way to get connected to the Discord. It sends us direct notifications to give us that edge and clarity within the charts, and you can receive this edge and clarity that you deserve within the volatility of the markets to maximize on the opportunities, whether stocks are going up or going down. You can now gain access to these resources and join the members using these resources, receiving that edge and clarity within the volatility to the markets, whether stocks are jumping up, going down, bearish or bullish, no FOMO, no chasing, just focused on what really matters and maximizing within those moves. As always, guys, thank you guys so much for watching and let's make 